Greetings, Fortnite Fanatics, Toy Insanity, presenting the Fortnite Insanity on Fortnite Fridays. Got three more of the Wave 2 or Series 2 Battle Royale figures from Moose. They are short packing these. So you'll see the rest of this wave in stores. Moisty Merman, Funk Ops, Chomp Sr., this dude, what's his name? Bright Gunner. And of course, Rabbit Raider. You'll see those dudes several times per case, per store. I've only seen Red Knight one time. I mean, it is a legendarily rare skin in game anyway. And I've seen each of these only two times. I probably should have got the other two. It might have some substantial trade value. And I still have not seen the Porta Fort anywhere, but. I have heard that it's out. Let's get these boys and girls looked. Oh, and look, and don't forget this. They're still teasing us with Crackshot. Crackshot was on the Series 1 or Wave 1 packaging. Where the heck is Crackshot? Are they going to wait till next Christmas time to release Crackshot? And I do check eBay. I mean, uh, not constantly, but I looked at eBay right before doing this video. Nobody's got crack shot. I guess we should look at this figure order number. I guess checklist number 29 31 33. Hopefully this means they're going to do a poster. Come on Moose, do a poster. Muscle Men did a poster. Battle Beast did a poster. I think Monster in My Pocket did a poster. Tech Deck Dudes even did a poster. I just think it's awesome. You have a you have a toy line of a hundred figures. You make this two foot by three foot poster, just showing everything in order. Aerial threat. It's probably gonna need the stand. He gets that famous gun and a soccer ball that he cannot hold. There's no plug mechanism. Oh, but there is. Oh, the soccer ball is his back bling, huh? I ain't even a gamer. Well, it can't be right. There's no way to plug it in his back. But you can do this. It's kind of cool for all you FIFA heads. World Cup Masters. Two girls, World Cup. Aerial Threat. This is your boy Sledgehammer. I don't know much about him, but I guess in, he's a pretty rare skin. No, I don't know. This is a rare skin. This is a legendarily rare skin. I don't know anything about this guy. He just looks like a boring army guy to me. I mean, he's just got two guns. No cool back bling. No cool harvesting tool. Definitely one of my least favorites overall. And I think the first appearance in any toy line, the only exception would possibly be the Mighty Beans. But I don't, I'm not even sure if he's in the Mighty Beans. Sledgehammer. Kind of a Chuck Norris looking dude. Already lost these guns. Here they are. And finally, finally, the highlight of the day. Red Knight. With their harvesting tool called the Crimson. Come on, baby. This is 
far as like boyfriend, girlfriend pairings, I mean, that's how I conceptualize it. Maybe they're a uh, brother and sister. <laughs> well, I guess I should figure out which one is actually correct. But so far we got Cuddle Team Leader and Love Ranger. We've got Bright Gunner and Bright Bomber. And we got Black Knight and Red Knight. Is there one more pairing? We don't have Tricera Ops. Probably some pairing that I don't even know about. Man, Moose throws that ghoul trooper. That's my girl. All right. The new wave, the newest additions. As soon as I get that port fort I'm not even sure who comes in it. We can drop a little video showing all the Series 2 Battle Royale figures. Also, hit me up if you have any leads on that crack shot. What is the deal? Why is he on both the checklist but not in any of the stores? All right, my dudes. I'm Toy Insanity. Appreciate that upvote. Thanks for looking at this video. I'll see you next Friday. Take care.